Thank you, Rob. We've got a GMA exclusive now. Donnie and Marie Osmond making a big announcement about their Las Vegas show. They sat down with Paula Ferris to talk about it. Good morning, Paula. Good morning, George. You know, this show was supposed to last six weeks. They're now in their 11th year at the Flamingo Casino and Resort in Vegas. They invited me backstage, and for them, this is much more than a show. You have a big announcement. Care to share? Do you want to say it or shall I say it? I think you've been dying to say it for years. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> it's been rumored that we're bringing Donnie and Marie to an end here in Las Vegas. And we're here to say it's official. Is that hard to say? It's very, very hard. The sibling duo has been on stage together for more than 40 years. I'm a little bit country and I'm a little bit rock and roll. But this November, they'll take their last bow in their Vegas show. It's up with the Osmonds. Their Friday night show was one of TV's biggest hits, 14 million viewers. I think that there's there's a unique chemistry exactly. and people love that sibling sound. And a visit knock, backstage, knock. proof that they truly are brother and sister. He was saying that all of the money goes into well, your wardrobe and shoes. Well, he doesn't pay for Jack. It's all me, okay? Okay, yeah, that's right. <laughs> But after decades of performing, their fans are a big reason the end will be bittersweet. They've come from all over the world right. to see us here in Vegas. The woman sitting behind me started screaming and said, I've waited for this moment my entire life. Oh my Aww. goodness. Is that mm -hmm. the sweetest? It is. I want you to look at one another okay. and Go tell ahead. me what you're thinking. All right. Do I look like you? <laughs> <laughs> I hope I don't look like that. All joking aside, they say it's their show so that got them through tough times. We have been through so much the last 11 years, her particularly, and she gets on stage and she's such a professional and she does a great job. I'm going to miss this a lot. I have been through a lot, but he's been my rock. I went through a terrible divorce here did she do? and a terrible custody battle and I lost a child here what she's gone through and still remained a professional and goes out there and performs for the audience. Oh, sweet. And it, there's, there's, a, there's a bond here that will never be broken. You know each other's buttons and I will never let anybody hurt him. Just me. Just her. <laughs> and she's, she does a good job at it. <laughs> But when it comes time for the grand finale, what kind of yeah. tricks do you have up your sleeve for your final show? I have no tricks. I'm just going to go out there and I'm going to have the time of my life. It's the end of the Donnie and Marie show. It's not the end of Donnie and Marie. May tomorrow be a perfect day. At the end of our interview, I asked them to sing their famous sign off to the old Donnie and Marie show. May tomorrow. Okay. Be a perfect day. May is too hot. May you fine. I sound like okay. a guy. <laughs> Perhaps they're not quite ready to let go. May God keep you in his tender care. Till he brings us together again. Good night, Marie. Good night, everybody. emotions about ending it, but they say it is time. They're both planning on stepping out of their comfort zones and doing something new, reinventing themselves. Marie has some film roles lined up. Donnie is working on a 60-second album with the last show, November 16th. George, I went to the show. People were losing their minds. And you can see why it's lasted so long. It sure it has. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.